Shalom, Shalom. Before I get started, I want to give all praises, glory and honor to Yahweh, Bahasham, Yahweh Shah, Bahasham, Harakak Wadash, double honors to the other apostles, great millstone, rule and teach well, and honors and salutations to the men of the Lord doing the same and teaching the same. All right, just want to jump straight into it. Um, the title of this lesson will be uh, Be Like Yahweh Shah. Okay, be like Yahweh Shah. Okay, and um, the title might be slightly different, but that's basically um, the lesson, all right, and the theme of this lesson be like Yahweh Shah. Okay, and I got a bunch of precepts, you know, just um, you know, to further make this message uh, plan upon tables and Lord willingness edifying unto the elect of the nation of Israel. All right. So, uh, you know, be like Yahweh Shah, okay? And Matthew 25 and 40, I'm using this precept to basically say we're, we're all um, are, are, you know, imitating Yahweh Shah, okay? And we all are basically uh, many versions, M-I-N-I, -I, uh, many versions of Yahweh Shah, okay? So basically, when you look to your left and to your right, all right, you know, the brother, you know, the ak, the akim, all right, that we see laboring day in and day out, all right, for Yahweh Bahashem, Yahweh Shah, you know, you, you should be looking at all of them, you know, including yourself, all right, uh, like y'all are a, 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 a bunch of Yahweh Shahs, so to speak, okay? You know, so basically, you know, a brother, um, and there's a scripture on that, but I'm not going to get it, but uh, like roughly paraphrasing the Lord said, how can you love me whom you have not seen, you know, but you don't love your own brother who you see, all right, every day, you know, so that's roughly paraphrasing, but I know uh, the elect know that verse, all right, and what I mean, okay? So we basically got to, uh, as you grow in this truth, you know, you start to uh, look at it like that, okay? And um, that's why you, you, you treat, um, um, what's the, yeah, reverence. That's why you treat brothers, uh, you start to learn and understand and, and, and treat brothers, all right, with that, uh, level of reverence, okay? That's why, you know, Yahweh Shah told us to uh, uh, prefer one another, all right? Okay? <clears throat> and to hold each other in high, higher esteem, all right? You know, than, you, than yourselves, okay? So that's just, you know, really going back into bro brotherly love, all right? And Yahweh Shah gave us an example of that, you know, with washing the disciples' feet, okay? So that takes a lot of humility, all right, and meekness, you know, which that's uh, fruits of the Spirit, okay? Which uh, Rome wasn't built in a day, okay? You're not just going... Um, and I understand why why uh, the apostles, you know, mainly Elder Apostle Gabar spoke on, um, there's like four levels to when you come into this truth you know and brothers they know exactly what I'm talking about you know you got the the monkey the uh, parrot all right uh the owl and the dragon okay and if I got it wrong please correct me but it's levels like Rome wasn't built in a day all right <clears throat> I don't care who you is you're not about to come in this truth and just be the perfect uh prophet the perfect uh man of the lord okay it takes time but it should be growth there should be growth all right it shouldn't shouldn't be no stagnant or it shouldn't be no decreasing or just staying the same it, sh it should most definitely be growth okay so it's you know this truth it molds you it this truth molds you into being just like Yahweh Shah Okay, <clears throat> so uh, 
Lord willing, this is edifying. This Matthew 25 and 40. And the king shall answer and say unto them, Verily I say unto you, Inasmuch as ye have done it unto one of the least of these, my brethren, ye have done it unto me. Right. That's why I said um, the elect, all right, that believe in and have faith in Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shah, all right. <clears throat> you know, we're, 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 you should be looking at one another as if, uh, you know, we're many versions of Yahweh Shah, okay? <clears throat> okay? And with having that mindset is going to help you, like, um, it's going to help you treat brothers uh, even more holy, all right, in this truth, okay? Because you're going to be looking at this truth and the body, the church of Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shah, you're going to be looking at it through a spiritual um, eye lens, all right? You're going to be using your, your uh, spiritual vision, all right, <clears throat> to, uh, you know, to look look at this truth and better understand this truth, okay? Okay? So, uh, Lord, like I say, Lord, when this is edifying, this is just a, a, a idea that, you know, really popped up in my mind. So I'm like, yeah, let me do a sit down on it. All right? <clears throat> So this is John, John 1 and 1, John 1 and 1. In the beginning was the word, which is Yahweh Shah, and the word was with Yahweh, and the word was a power, okay? <clears throat> so Yahweh Shah, all right, he's a power as well. He's a God as well, but Yahweh Shah is under uh, Yahweh, the heavenly father, the supreme being, okay? The same was in the beginning with Yahweh, okay? So I want to stop right there. All right. And notice the scriptures call Yahweh Shah the word. All right. Yahweh Shah, he's the embodiment of the scriptures. Okay. And even the scriptures tell us that, you know, uh, the law, statutes, commandments, they point, they point that they direct you directly to the source, Yahweh Shah. All right. And Yahweh Shah is directing us to who? Yahweh. Okay. So he's the word, all right? You know, so we're trying to what? We're trying to be like Yahweh Shah. You know, how they say, I want to be, I want to be like Mike. All right? <clears throat> okay? And that's spiritual in itself, all right? Because I think uh, uh, Michael, uh, it goes back into being like the Most High. Okay, the, word, the name Michael goes back to being like the Most High. All right, so you wanna you you know you wanna be like uh, Yahweh Shah. Okay, so like y'all thought somebody was messing with my donut, but uh, Revelation, in Revelation, I, yeah, I'm gonna get it since I it was on my spirit to get this precept. Because uh, it's basically, I'm using it to say the same thing. But this Revelation 19 and 13, and he was clothed with a vesture dipped in blood, which that's parabolic. Because Yahweh Shah, who the world falsely and ignorantly, all right, called Jesus Christ. That's not his true name. His true name is Yahweh Shah. All right. The Lord is going to kill lots of people when he come back to this earth and those so-called UFOs. All right which are chariots according to the Bible, the vehicles of the angels, all right? So when the Lord come back, he's going to kill a lot of people, okay? And the Bible, the Bible makes that perfectly clear. And his name is called the Word of Yahweh, okay? So Yahweh Shah, he's the embodiment of the scriptures, okay? All right? <clears throat> So it says, uh, well, that's it. I'm tripping. That's it. That's all I wanted. Get to the next precept. Mark the perfect man. Okay. I got this, this scripture coming up next. And Yahweh Shah, he's the perfect man. Okay. 
And we all, that's, that's one thing all of the elect have in common. All right. Yes, all of the elect have different personalities. All right. And traits about themselves. OK. But our minds are single for us. This truth, this doctrine. All right. OK. So our, our minds, all of us want to be like Yahweh Shah. OK. All of us uh, yearn and desire to be with Yahweh Shah in the kingdom of heaven. And we want Yahweh Shah with the host of the angels to come back to the earth and save us. All right. You know, but Yahweh, he's going to give the orders uh, for when Yahweh Shah and the angels will attack. Okay. So call her law Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shah. So this Matthew, uh, Matthew 10 and 41. Matthew 10 and 41. All right. He that receiveth a prophet in the name of a prophet shall receive a prophet's reward. And he that receiveth a righteous man in the name of a righteous man shall receive a righteous man's reward. Right. So uh, when you take heed to a prophet of Yahweh Bahashem Yahweh Shah, all right, and you repent and you believe on Yahweh Bahashem Yahweh Shah, all right, and start keeping the law, statutes, commandments. Uh, through faith and to the best of your ability, guess what? Uh, uh, you're going to receive the same reward that that righteous prophet, that man of the Lord uh, is going to receive. Okay? Because that man brought you back to uh, uh, Yahweh Bahashem Yahweh Shah. That's our sole purpose. That's our job. Okay? And that's the only reason you know you should be in this truth. Okay? If you not, if if that's not uh, on your mind, all right, and that's not your uh, what you in in this truth for, then you 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 probably now it's it's more than one reason why we um, in this faith in this truth, okay, and I can name you a couple for myself, all right. Not only am I doing the work that Yahweh Bahashem Yahweh Shah commanded me, all right, but also I want I want uh, spiritual powers. I want to fly. I want to run fast. I want to be super strong. Okay. I want to drive a chariot. All right. I want my own planet. I want multiple multiple wives. So that's just personal. That's just personal wants. Okay. But uh, uh, overall, all right, we all want and yearn for the return of Yahweh Shah. You know, we want to drink that wine with Yahweh Shah. We, you know, we want to behold Yahweh Shah. Okay, and that's just going to be something uh, just to see how it shot for the first time. All right, to witness perfection. Okay, so you know that's that's how you're supposed to look at it. All right, so mark the perfect man, and who, who are the perfect men on the earth, beginning with the elder apostles, great millstone, on down to le least of us. All right, we represent Yahweh Shah. All right. Yahweh Bahashem Yahweh Shah. Okay. We represent the church, the body of Yahweh Shah. All right. So you got to take heed to, to uh, us men of the Lord, Lord willing them of the elect number. All right. We ain't going to tell you nothing wrong. All right. Yeah, I, I, I got a lot of scriptures. Um, I'm not going to get all these. But that's how the spirit be. You know, when you get ready. Yeah. I'm uh, Let's see. Jump to certain ones. I definitely want Psalms 37 and 37. All right. So there's Psalms, Psalms 37 and 37. Mark the perfect man and behold the upright for the end of that man is peace right okay so you should be uh uh copying copying the anastrophe of you know men of the lord you know that possess the fruits of the spirit okay and that's on you know divine uh uh divine a uh, divine timeline okay you know and just because they're moving in the spirit of Yahweh Shah anyway. All right. So, in the, you know, we all go in the same direction. All right. 
you know. And uh, you naturally, you by being a a a fault because we all are compared to sheep, so you're naturally going to copy one another anyway. So uh, if you you copy in the men of the Lord and moving how we move now in in you know uh, knowledge, wisdom, knowledge, understanding. Okay, not being a blind follower like Christians. Okay, studying to show yourself approved. All right. <clears throat> You know, because the Lord love of none but him that dwelleth with wisdom. Okay? You know, so we're all leaders, but we it's a hierarchy. It's a hierarchy. We're all leaders, but we're not all on the same level. All right? <clears throat> it's a hierarchy. You know? And you can see it. All right? And you can feel it. All right? But this hierarchy is set up by Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh Shah. All right? The church of the church, the body of Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shah. All right, the house of David. Okay? And that's how you gotta move and think. Okay? So mark the perfect man. <clears throat> you know? And I'll give you an example from when I first came in, you know, and um about uh uh how the old folks said, um Something like a uh, old cat. It's something the old folks be saying. Something dealing with um, young cat or old cat. You know. <clears throat> Wait, so like, first let me find the precept I wanted. I'm not gonna get all the precepts I wanted, but I'ma get the bangers. Let's see. Uh. Definitely, I'ma just, I'ma just, I'ma end it on this one. All right, <clears throat> you know, but uh, when I first came into the truth, you know, uh, and I linked up with the Rasha, who's now, you know, fell out the truth, no longer believe in Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shah. Okay, but um, when I first came in. You know, and I ended up finding out that he believed in Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai as well. You know, and um, I came to find out that uh, he'd been watching, you know, Great Millstone for four years. You know, and I found that out through us studying together. You know, studying, studying to show yourself approved, trying to get built up in the spirit. Okay, and I, I came to the realization that he was way ahead of me, you know? He was way ahead of me. And um, I was doing what the scripture said, you know? Uh, I was trying to be like him as, at one point, okay? But you know, through Yahweh Baha Shem, Yahweh Shah, he always, he have, he have, uh, he has always different plans for you that you don't see, okay? You know, that's why things are the way they are now. All right. But when I first came in, you know, I was looking at that brother like, damn, he's super deep, you know. And um, that's not really uh, uh, broad information. You know, a lot of people didn't know he was already really on a level. And I came to find out when we was uh, studying together, you know, so he had to hit helped me to a lot of uh, wisdom, knowledge, understanding. But now he's a bug out, so, you know, all that hard work, you know, was for nothing. All right? <clears throat> and me and him went to school together, too, you know, and we was, uh, we was tight, how the old folks said, we was tight. All right? So, yeah. But, yeah, so that's an example of marking the perfect man, all right? And um, uh, copying, I should say, you know, good traits and qualities of fruits of the spirit that you see that brother have. Okay, that's that's um, also uh, it's beneficial. Okay, it's it's beneficial. Okay, 
So, but this first Corinthians 11 and one, be ye followers of me, even as I also am of Yahweh Shah Hamashiach. All right. And you best believe the uh, uh, prophets in the ancient times, the disciples in the ancient times, okay, uh, and the ones that's not mentioned, okay, they was marking the perfect man, uh, Paul, okay? They were seeing how he moved, okay? You know, okay, that's that's how that brother uh, moving and teaching, et cetera, et cetera, all right? Oh, I, that's how he treating brothers, you know, things like that. You know, so you have perfect examples walking the earth, you know, beginning with the elder apostles, Gray Millstone. I'm down to, uh, you know, uh, the least of us. All right. So Lord willing of the elect number, Lord willing, this made sense. OK, want to uh, about to go ahead and shut it down. All right. So uh, Lord willingness was edifying when it ended and give all praises, glory and honor to Yahweh, Bahasham, Yahweh Shah, Bahasham, Harakak Wadash. All right. And double honors to the old apostles, great millstone, ruling to teach well. Honors and salutations to the men of the Lord, doing the same and teaching the same. Shalom.